Well, we were looking at patients with early stage, stage stage two and stage three, HER2 positive breast cancer. And I think in that space, the biggest unmet need at the moment is that we have this expanding um, set of options for how we treat them. We can give a lot of chemotherapy, we can give a lot of anti-HER2 drugs, we can give a little chemotherapy, we could give no chemotherapy and only anti-HER2 drugs. So it's a good problem to have in some ways. We have all these different options. Um, but a big issue at the moment is we don't know how to customize them. We don't know how to figure out which patient needs the most that we can give them, which patient could get away with a lot less and obviously be spared unnecessary toxicity.